Hey guys, welcome to my room tour. Um, also, thank you for 200, or not 200, 370 subs. Now, you might be wondering, why does this say 300, uh, and 360 subscriber special if uh, I have 370 subs? Easy question. I've been working on cleaning things up around here since I got... 100, uh, 360 subscribers, so, uh, for, uh, 370, I'm actually doing a live stream on Wednesday, uh, uh, next week, yeah, Wednesday, next week, so, I'm gonna be doing this room tour, and I'm starting off on my desk, here's my Acer Nitro 5, a gaming laptop, with, uh, my mouse, and my horrible cable management, yeah, I know, um, it's kind of bad. I also have this heater here because my room gets super cold. Uh, and I have some lavender here to keep, like, mosquitoes away. And it's all dried so it doesn't rot or anything. Also, I shouldn't have done that because now it's on my computer. I have to, like, clear it off. No, I don't want to launch Minecraft right now. I don't want to launch Minecraft right now. Anyways, here I have um, two lights. One is LED and one is not. I need to... I, one is, like, a normal bulb light. I need to fix that and get two LEDs. Also, this one is supported by a thing like this. And I'm thinking about getting that right there and putting this on that. Only problem is this right here is a lot heavier and a lot, the base is a lot bigger. This is just something for Minecraft coordinates, by the way. Uh, then this. This base is a very tiny little base. Here I have my custom Fortnite figures. Uh, the ones I've made so far. Now, on top of here, it's kind of... I have this random rock here. I don't necessarily know why. And I have some paint on it, too. I don't know why, either. A little Santa bag, C-3PO Santa. Uh, a little speeder, Thanos. Uh, some figures, Warhammer guys. And then some custom LEGO Supreme stickers. And a globe with glow-in-the-dark um, star constellations. And just, like, a... Roadmap of possible future videos and uh, like poster, sticker, card. Really old drawing. Really old drawing. <laughs> Gosh darn it. I cannot tell you how old that freaking drawing is. Um, and then like some chores and crap. But, um, anyways, this right here, I actually. A Boy Scout like arrow of light thing was here, but um, basically what. My friend Michael did is he got one of my plush snakes from over there, put it on my ceiling fan, and then turned on the ceiling fan, and that arrow of light went flying. So we're still, um, basically, I don't know, we're we're still gonna put it up here, but for now I just have the drift mask just hanging. Uh, anyways, also, this little overview of my room as I spin on chair. Uh, it's not a gaming chair, I think it's actually just like a normal chair. I have like a little jacket hanging on it. Um, I, <laughs> I'm gonna continue the tour from here. No, I'm joking. Um, little medieval times flag. Um, some school supplies, pencils, stuff. Another really old artwork thing on that one. Old, old clock too, but it actually... It has the correct time. Is it one? Yeah, it's one. Yeah, one minute ahead. Uh, anyways, and then, like, a little post-it thing that I have my webcam on. This is not my stream, by the way. You can see the background is way different than my streams. <laughs> Ninjago poster, Pokemon poster. Um, Iron Man poster right there. Love that, uh, classic comic. It's actually, like, a wooden plaque, I guess you could say, of Iron Man. I have it on the window there. Nice view, too. Um, and then right here, some custom stuff. Random stuff. And then there, there's just some more random stuff. Uh, around here. These are, like, Target things I made. Like, when I was, like, I don't know, four. I have no idea what I was going for with them. Um, but I ended up using them for, like, BB guns and stuff years later. 
Um, and these were, like, little shield things. We were doing, like, a Viking thing in Boy Scouts. And, like, the night before the actual thing, it was, like, really early in the morning, too. But, like, the night before that, I had this idea to make little shield things. Because we had this big sled with, like, all sorts of stuff in it. So, I made those. Um, also, I felt bad because I was sick a bunch of, uh, Boy Scout meetings before that. So, I wasn't really able to help with the thing. And once I got there... Um, to actually work on the thing, I got, like, one day to work on the thing, and I did not really understand what was going on, um, but all kind of personal stuff. Anyways, pick a brick containers, pick a brick caps, uh, Pokeball, just some random cards in it, nothing really good. Got this at one of Spacey's past birthday parties, um, might bring it somewhere, because it's useful, it's like a fan water it's something cool. Some origami stuff that I've been given over the years. Uh, ooh, my YouTube colors. The darker orange and lighter blue. It's cool. Lego Dimensions poster. I uh, got the little minifigure chart things. Two pieces of Julian's, my friend Julian's artwork. And um, his artwork has greatly improved. Um, but these are just like... 2017, 2018, we were gonna do a series called Mystery Quest, um, he hates this artwork now, by the way, because it's really old, uh, his artwork is even, that was him, like, two years ago now, his artwork has really improved, he has an Instagram account that, that's right there, anyways, all sorts of Warhammer stuff going there, um, minifigures, and down here, I'm working on collecting series 16, uh, just because it's a very nostalgic series for me. Um, and then I have this, which is like my... It has some Warhammer stuff in it, and some dice and stuff. It's like a little carry-on for miniatures. And then I have this, like, monkey um, piggy bank thing. Talk about piggy banks. Here are my poor stonks next to a photo album one. Yes, I have a very small amount of stonks. Uh, yeah, over here, I also have my clone army. This is a, like, sound thing. I don't necessarily know what this is. A origami, some parts from Brick Fair. Um, this I made, like, when I was in elementary school or something. Just never really got around to taking it down. Kind of just keep it here. Um, uh, silver coin from Bear Mountain. It's cool. Uh, this Wonder Woman figure that I got in, like, a random video. Um years ago, I don't really know, this Harry Potter wand, I got, uh, at a party, it was, like, homemade, so I found that cool, my Brick Fair ba uh, badge, which is missing two parts, I think they're under here, maybe, yeah, they are, I see them, um, I had two more bricks at the bottom, I had, like, a Citizen Brick one, and a, a Clone of Me Custom, Economy Custom uh, Citizen Brick one, and an Empire Lug one. And I also have a small amount of coins. There's like a $2 coin there, and a little, like, $1 roll, or, like a roll of pennies or something. Uh, G Notion. Some, the reason why I have caps is because my friend Spacey, um, outside of gaming, he's gonna do, like, a IRL game, and the currency for that is gonna be caps. Um, and you're gonna be able to, like, buy really cool things, um, for, uh, your character. It's not, it's not roleplay, it's more, um, like a real-life Empires game, I guess you could call it? Something like that? It's kind of like an Apocalypse game, but it's not really roleplay, it's kind of more, um, like, you build, like, we're building, uh, like a, I wouldn't say battle zone. It, it's hard to explain, uh, plus, I'd need to get his green light if I was actually to make a video about it once it happens. Some string here because I never know when I'm going to need it. A controller for the pile driver and a little Lego coin. Pile driver is this thing. This little poop thing that Robert gave me. And then some custom stuff. Some just random figures, mostly like from Team Eleven. Uh, random stuff. Star Wars stuff. Like, random builds and stuff for LEGO Dimensions, I think. Yeah, yeah, that's stuff for LEGO Dimensions. 
Oh, uh, let's see. This is stuff like school supplies stuff. Um, like paper and pencils. So, kind of like that, too. Not really organized, by the way. Uh, Warhammer stuff. Paint. Um, electronic stuff. These are all used gift cards, by the way. I kind of just cut them up and use them for, um, pieces on customs. Uh, this is like old school, this is like a really old school supply thing that I don't even use, uh, colored pencils and stuff, I think this is like art stuff, and like tattoos and crap, uh, this is like a personal thing, I, I wouldn't even call it personal, um, I don't know why I have a whale sticker there, uh, it's just like kind of random, this is also like random, this is like stuff in bags, so like cards and, um, pins, these old like, pirate coin things, uh, sort of random stuff, kind of like props, and at the bottom here, I have no idea, here I have like, no idea, here is like, I, my rock collection stuff, like, I have a little rock thing, here, um, yeah, this is definitely the, about the rock thing, of, like, quartz there, this is all for, like, movie projects, costumes. I just have all sorts of blank shirts I've bought at, like, craft stores. Uh, here... Oh, this is, like... This is, like, the little good stuff. This is, like, puzzles. Um, not... Puzzles and, like, weird games and music stuff. And then, like, weird games like fidget spinners. And then this is, uh, Boy Scouts supplies. Yeah. Alright. And then... So on this shelf here, the shelf here, this little like moonlight thing has like a switch up there. I also have a star one, star one, little like dream catcher thing I got at a fair once. I don't necessarily know, um, but star, star, uh, but moon thing here, and then I have some books. Some of these are actually like Pokemon binders, and like I have some more down there. Some like Minecraft stuff I tried to decorate it with. Uh, Legos, Mandalorians, all sorts of stuff. All right. Well, and also, um, oh, shoot. I <laughs> almost just fell off the chair. Uh, anyways, I can show you this now. Clone Army stuff. Um, this is a thing for, uh, Captain America First Avenger mod. Uh, this is also a quad that my friend gave me a while ago. Uh, and this is a Shock Trooper helmet. I actually have a lot of Shock Troopers, guys. All these shock troopers. Hmm. This is like a DNA thing we did in science last year. And also, by the way, these are like over here. These are like things I always had as like a little kid, kind of like the this thing. Just never really thought I need to take it down. Uh, this right here, funny story. My friend, um, when he was in my school, he's like a couple years older than me, so he's not anymore. Um, or not until next year. But anyways. Uh, basically, he put these all over the school, he had to take them down, and then when he was, I asked if I could keep one for, like, my YouTube setup, and he said, sure. I also have a Supreme sticker, 20 years of Pokemon, uh, some Fortnite action figure lists, and also the two, um, Fortnite retail exclusive things, and, like, some Fortnite figures, Hot Wheels, uh, anniversary stuff. A B-Wing that my friend Robert gave me. This coin I got Legoland last year. Um, this thing and the other thing. The, this thing. Um, some person in New York City was, like, selling them. So, I don't necessarily... Uh, no. All I know is when I try to get the stuff, they, um, get my way. <laughs> um, but they do look very nice. Um, my 501st ATAP, which I kind of customized. Um... Iron Man's, Iron Men, I guess, just, yeah, Iron Man's, Iron Man suits. Oh, uh, this thing, <laughs> awkward story. Um, so I was in, like, Disneyland or World, the, whichever one was in Florida, and I came back, and my grandma, like, bought me all this Kelowna stuff and put it in this wooden thing that I, I had, like, random Legos in, and I just haven't moved it ever since. I probably should have, so, uh, I, I probably should have before, uh, before recording this video, so I didn't need to go into that, but, 
you know what, whatever. Also, this right here, um, is a school thing. It's like, I'm out of here. It is last year. I hated it. So my mom bought me that. This I made when I first got into Minecraft. It's horrible. Don't judge. I have a broken down ATAT, -AT, which I need to repair. Broken down Star Destroyer, which I need to repair. A Unikitty set that I got for like $7. It was, it's $7. You can't pass up a deal like that for these amazing figures. Oh my god. No, I'm, I'm joking. I just got it because I was really bored. And there was a Lego bundle deal. And... The actual set itself looked interesting, so I'm just like, whatever, whatever. This thing, this is Captain Rex's AT, ATT, it's not done, it's actually kind of falling apart, I need to, I need to get on that, and here I have like random stuff, my old drift mask, these like treasure chest things that I painted as a little kid, this like hockey puck, I don't know. I, I don't even know... Alright, it's a Dallas team. Um, I know my friend, um, he's into... I forgot what hockey team he likes, but... Uh, me, him, and his sister were walking down to the dollar store once because I was sleeping over his house. Um, Brian, yes, Brian, Lieutenant Rex. He's on my feature channels. And uh, I think either him or his sister was wearing um, merch of the hockey team they like. And then the, um, a police car, uh, passed by us, and then they said, uh, let's go, and then that team name, I just keep on forgetting what it is. Oof. Anyways, just a bunch of random vehicles, Charizard, Mega Bloks thing. This table right here, uh, some Micro World stuff, Star Wars sets, um, the Battle Pack things, the shuttle, the, or the shuttle transport thing, and this little 3D project for school, and some Lego parts, this little battle on Cloud City mock, that, um, it's like a mini thing I'm working on, and these little containers, uh, my bed, some random stuff over here, uh, like a Nerf gun, stuff I'm cool right here, I actually have a real, like, ammo box with all the Nerf ammo, um, might paint a yellow on that, like the ones in Fortnite. This is my uh, drift costume. Not not the drift costume I made. Uh, this is the one that Spirit Halloween uh, released a year later. And then this was the last Halloween costume. I never actually showed this. This is Leon Kennedy from Resident Evil 2. So that's cool. Uh, I got a Porg and this little dart thing. So if you don't hit the dart thing, you hit the Porg. Or you hit the ground. Um, I spilled paint here. <laughs> you can see where I've done, like, paint spills. It's... <laughs> looks so bad. Uh, just a bunch of random stuff here. Uh, including, like, this little LED thing. Um, lotion. Because, you know, this room gets cold. That's why I have the heater. But my hands still get, like, super crusty. Oof. It's, um, TMI. Anyways. Also, the outside of my windows have, like, these little, like middle wood bits that get like really dusty but it's like outside so it's you know kind of awkward i have some metals here and a little um artwork thing of starry night anyways um minecraft world here which is kind of falling apart random pieces uh just some lego sets here oh container here full of all sorts of stuff and parts down here this right here is just, like, sets ready to build at a friend's house whenever I need to, or whenever I want to. But I'm probably going to end up building them uh, when I get bored, and that's a random Lego bag. And my knee just, like, freaking made a sound. Am I, am I getting old? Am I going to, like, break my leg just from walking up a flight of stairs? I think I might. Anyways, um... There's one thing I completely forgot, and that's... I just rammed that into the desk. And that's this pile of randomness. This is box that used to hold my lamp here. This I'm using for a prop. I kind of just went to a restaurant and asked for an extra one because I knew I could use it for something. This was like reference pictures. I was going to make a mock of a Venator and a figure of him. And rest, this is like a 
card game that my friends and I made, uh, keep in here, and all, like, Lego, um, instructions and stuff. What else? Um, containers! Here! Oof, okay. Um, this is, like, a bad attempt at organizing. I have a little custom craggle thing. Use, like, a whiteout sharpie and an old used crazy glue container and like an old aerial light helmet down there yeah i also have my gun chip some this is like a weird custom thing i think i yeah this is for team 11 i don't know what i was going to use it for though um just some random stuff my world war ii uh, higgins boat here which i probably should redo gumball machine uh, that I made in school, and also sets, so, Ninjago set, actually, there's one above it, X-Wing, Ninjago set, these are all things that need to be built, uh, Hobbit set, um, what is this, I think this is Lego Movie, e no, that's Hobbit, uh, Lego Movie's at the bottom, yeah. And I have, like, some sets that need to be built. Uh, medieval Times Sword. Uh, this is, like, random stuff, but good stuff, so I'm gonna show you guys. Got all of these for $2. Not each, like, all of them combined $2. Um, they're supposed to be a dollar each, but I got a steal from one of MNR's friends. MNR sold his friend a big box, and then he was selling a bunch of things. His friend was selling a bunch of things from the box, and I got a bag of all those sour brick patch kid things and it was cool world war ii brick arm or just like brick arms in general don't know why this classic blaster is here uh some not sized correctly decals some water slide decals um weapons minifigures like historical minifigures mixed with like captain america first avenger stuff Cause I'm doing a Captain America First Avenger mock, but it is, it's like, so that's why I have like Hydra mixed in with like actual like soldier minifigures. And just like sort of random minifigures. I wish I actually had an actual camera to record this with, cause my phone can't focus cause it's a, it's a dummy Android. Um, random parts here, and just like random sets. Completely random stuff, Minecraft, and then stuff from Mandalore, which I should probably look through. Um, yeah, that is actually it. I have my little uh, Fortnite thing as well. This is like a mini golf kit, I guess, and tic-tac-toe at the back. And then this. Um, this year I'm actually going to try to get this orange and light blue to make the actually... The proper colors. And then my mom just like gave me a whole bunch of bricks with my name on them. I, I don't know why. But I just have a whole bunch. And then I also have this little thing from Legoland. That you can build and pay to keep. Uh, yeah, that is literally everything. Every, oh wait, no. I still have these shelves. I'll go through them quick. Uh, Chrome figure. This was like a trivia little trivia gift at Legoland's on its opening week. Oh my god, it, it's not freaking focusing because there's no light. It says Lego Star Wars 2013. Ray, some clone helmets, a gold brick, not a, like a solid gold brick or anything, just like a printed gold brick. Uh, this little rock. I, this rock. I don't know, I've just had it sitting around my room. Like, since, like, 2009 or something. So, it, it's actually become, like, nostalgic for no reason. You can get a better look. The Tron stuff here. The amazing Tron set. Need to get more of that. Dave & Buster's Cup. Uh, these are, like, my custom LEGO Fortnite qu uh, quad crasher. Back there. I know the lighting is really bad right now. I'll try to fix that. Oh, uh, yeah, Batman stuff. Also, little floating islands for Minecraft stuff. And then up here, you know, the two posters for uh, Marvel. I'm going to get the Endgame poster and also um, 
a Star Wars poster uh, for The Last Jedi. Not super big fan of Last Jedi, but at least the poster's cool. And some stuff up here, I guess I'll just show. And uh, there's some, like, random glass figures up here. And then, like, a uh, sealed uh, Toys R Us thing. It is sealed. Uh, some stuff up here. A little light cycle thing from Tron. And then that's a picture from someone who, sadly, um... Passed away two years ago, so that actually really sucked. Um, well, my mom's friends, but anyways, that that was a picture that they sent in the mail, kind of like a postcard once. Anyways, uh, some stuff here too, like a zombie, some like other stuff, Fortnite guns for the action figures. Um, but anyways, that's basically it, honestly. Um, it's really nothing else to show. Uh, that's the room tour. If you guys want a shout out and you like the video, or as in, if you guys like what I do on this channel and you guys want a shout out and you guys also like the video, then just like the video, sub, comment that, saying that you did that, and I'll give you a shout out. Planning on doing shout outs one of these weeks, maybe in a couple weeks. But, anyways, I'll see you guys later. Hope you enjoyed the video, as it's been a while in the making, and I'll see you guys later. Alright, bye guys.